community is outraged by the vandalism that happened at this business right here. And community officials tell me that that message is not what this community stands for and it will not be tolerated. Disgust and anger over racist graffiti. They don't deserve it, you know, and uh, nobody should ever wake up in the morning and ever feel less than anyone else. Someone wrote, Go back to Mexico on the back wall of Las Palmas. The message spotted yesterday and has leaders like Nathan Mallory, the president of the Brookline Chamber of Commerce, upset. You know, diversity is what makes Pittsburgh great. So when you see something like that, it just kind of stings a little. That sting being felt all throughout this community. Scott Smith owns the Party Cake Shop, just two doors down from the popular Mexican grocery store. He said the owners are good people and the vandalism is disgusting. Extremely disappointed. These gentlemen next door never bothered anybody. They come in every morning, do their job, take care of their family and their business, and they go home at night. Mallory said after contacting police, he cleaned off the graffiti himself, saying he wanted it gone as quickly as possible. But he also posted a picture of it on social media, and it went viral. It really upset a lot of people, and it really kind of grounded a lot of people to see that that kind of ignorance and that kind of racism and bigotry exists right here. And this community not standing for it, saying they stand behind this business 100%. Community officials tell me they plan on holding a rally in the upcoming days in support of Las Palmas. In the meantime, if you have any information on who may have done this, you're encouraged to give police a call. Reporting in Brookline, Caitlin Sykes, Pittsburgh's Action News 4. All right, thank